Hey guys, the next service that we're going to be self-hosting is called Direct Us. And this is what it's going to look like. Hey guys, the next service that we're going to self-host on Coolify is called Direct Us. And this is what it's going to look like. Let me show you how to self-host it. So the first thing we're going to do is add a project. We're going to call it Direct Us Tutorial. Select the production environment. Click add a new resource. Search for Direct Us. We're going to select Direct Us with Postgres SQL. That way we get the, the database out of the box. Select the server. And you are ready to self host. Now I am running my server on ARM64. And if I run this right now, I will get an error because it's expecting a different image. So to counter this, I am going to edit the compost file and add an image that has been built by the community with ARM64. So let's do that now. So hit edit compose file and scroll down to the Postgres SQL section. We're going to replace the image line here with the following line. So basically, we're editing the, the beginning here. Instead of postgis, it's going to say this and dash ARM64 and delete the platform line. Hit save and then hit deploy. So once it says that the Direct Us container has started. You can go ahead and close that. I'm going to refresh. And as you can see, it's not completely done. We've got running starting on the main Direct Us image. So we'll wait for that to be healthy. And you'll also see that this says exited. And as a result, the overall page says degraded unhealthy. But that's not true. Uh, the services we care about are going to be healthy, which is these three, Postgres, Redis, and Direct Us. So with that, we can now visit the URL, and I forgot to edit it before I deployed, but that is fine for the purpose of this tutorial. So let's copy and paste it in a new URL. And so now to sign in, you're going to, because you can't actually sign up, you need the credentials that are available on your service stack tab. So you've got the email and password, which um, if you want to change these before you actually deploy, you do that first and then deploy. So go ahead and copy the credential from the email and password and hit sign in. So direct us is basically an application that lives on top of a database. And it allows you to create collections and uh, manage users that can access your instance. You can also add files. You can also create dashboards and uh, modify your model later on down the line without having to worry about migrations and all that stuff. And interestingly, you can also have flows, which is something like um, a background job that runs when something happens and it's very very powerful for example let's say you've added a row to your table on that action you can do something else like you can notify yourself you can modify another record in another place it's really up to your imagination you can even set up an endpoint a custom webhook that if it is visited, will do something else. There are many things that you can do. I'm not going to go through it all because this is not the scope of this video. But all I will say is that um, Direct Us is so easy to use. You don't even need to use their documentation to get started. Honestly, you can just start by um, clicking on uh, creating a new collection and you'll basically get shown it step by step what it is that you have to do and uh, it couldn't be more intuitive so i highly recommend this and i will be searching for a way that i can use this in one of my side projects 
And with that, that's the end of this video. I'll see you in the next one.